as some 19,000 students prepare to sit the secondary entrance assessment on Thursday, dietetic technician attached to the Eric Williams Medical Sciences Complex in Mount Hope, Amber Charles, sat with reporter Janine Brown to discuss how parents can ensure their children are well nourished to deal with the stresses that comes in this period. Her main advice was that parents ensure their children maintain balance. The secondary entrance assessment or C is a defining moment in a child's life as their performance determines where they will spend the next five to seven years of their academic career. Dietetic technician Amber Charles is reminding parents that their child's nutrition should remain at the top of their priority list as far as preparation goes. Because at this time, as when you're studying that much, it can come off like you're exercising. Right? And you find that you're going to need to eat a little bit more. So you want to make sure that they always have that food available to them. The snacks between that available to them are nutritionally balanced. You, you know, it's not just going to cause them to crash later on because it's high in sugar. So you have maybe three or four meals throughout the day, small meals, with the snacks between, so that they always have something to reach for easily to eat. And that, she says, starts with the most important meal of the day, breakfast. We say food is essential because you must consume it for your body to function the way that it needs to function. It's an important meal. It basically sets the tone for your day you, so once it's healthy and balanced. So you're going to get the benefits of you'll be more mentally alert. So you're going to have the energy that you need for throughout the day. Um, you also find that it will contribute to your overall nutritional balance. While study sessions are important for success, all work and no play makes Jack a dull boy. Miss Charles says apart from upkeeping a nutritionally balanced diet to give the children the fuel they need to perform their best academically, parents ought to ensure the child maintains an active lifestyle. Whether that break means they go outside and they play, if they like to play an instrument, don't stop them from it because this creates a balance. It, it, it helps them to de-stress from all of the studying. Sometimes what you find as well, what works with me, when I am studying, if I study, I take a nap, I take a break, and I come back and I read it over, you find that I am able to recall it a lot better than if I had just tried to read everything straight through. With the exam mere days away at this stage, parents of young ones are urged to heed the professional advice so that when their child's turn rolls around, he or she is in the best health to do their best. Janine Brown, C News.